I hate being talented, ambitious, yet I'm unsatisfied. It keeps me up at night. Tomorrow I start a new day doing the same, <laughs> the same shite. There's more to me than what can I get? How can I be of service? I let go of my personality and <laughs> force this smile on, on purpose. Clucking my name. Hey, Jay. Good to see you've improved your attendance. Now, please, go make yourself look presentable. You're making these white folks nervous. Listen, I hate my job. I hate my life right now. Don't confuse my words. I don't, I don't hate my life. I just hate where it is right now. I have dreams, ambitions, fam. I can put on a show. I have issues you can read into and play out the drama, my mannerisms. But if you can tell this brother's from some sort of ghetto. They say put a vision past my stigmatism. Ah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I do mean stigma. Stigmatism is my left eye's condition, as it depreciates. It doesn't affect my diligence, you see. I do notice these things people call white privileges. And they say your future's bright, Jay. It doesn't matter if your skin is black or white. <laughs> Let's see if I get my tuition paid on time without complication or confusion. Listen, fuck the Fed. Sorry, that's... I'm sorry, that's just my form of Tourette's. <laughs> And this poem isn't even meant to be race influence. I, I just needed to vent. As I said, I hate being talented, ambitious and unsatisfied. My living room stairs as a platform. Everyone's an artist like it's the norm, but it puts me off. I don't even want to write these days. Let's see who would notice. <laughs> no one. They tell me stand out like a sore thumb, so yeah, I write my pain, frustration, aggression. Is that not sore enough? I tell my mama, say, Mom, I'm an artist. She says, That's not gonna pay the mortgage, son. I say, Mom, spare me your tough love. Right now, all I need is words of encouragement to get me to my destination. She says, Son, you have no patience. Every morning you rise and then fall as soon as darkness starts its invasion. And also she says, son, it's not for you to tell me about your intention and ambition. You see, your actions speak loud like your pockets, which are full of cannabis. <laughs> and on that note, Joshua, please don't do this for the fame or the riches. You see, family is God and love is the objective. <laughs> and you are his sacrifice. So I suppose I'm talented, ambitious, and soon I'll be satisfied. Mm-hmm.